Hey guys, so I decided to do a quick video update just to tell you how my hair is doing because since my last video, people have been asking me questions. Um, so hopefully I'm gonna answer most of the questions that I was asked in the previous video. And yeah, so if you're interested in seeing how my hair is doing, keep watching. Okay, so to start, you will recall that I used these, this hair relaxer. This is the Cream of Nature Straight From Eden hair relaxer. Um, honestly, I can say that it's the best hair relaxer ever because I feel as though my hair has actually been doing better with the relaxer than when it was natural. And part of it is that I feel like um, you know, it doesn't over bake my hair and maybe it's because I don't live it in for that long. Anyway, so my hair is doing fine and to be quite honest, um, I'm very happy with the way it's going. Um, it's so easy to just wash and go, which is something that I couldn't really do with my natural hair. Um, and, and then the other thing that I love is that, you know, when you work out, you can just like go to the gym or whatever do your workout and just not worry that oh my god my hair is gonna get messy you can literally go swimming you can do whatever you feel like and you'll be fine so um, in terms of my length my hair has different lengths so depending on which part of my head you're looking at so this is like sort of the middle-ish back so you can see it's there but then like when you see the front it's like here so, and then I know this part of my hair, it's thin or shorter, so it's like over here. Um, but yeah, so it's different lengths and um, right now the relax, I just did a retouch about two days ago, so my hair is still pretty flat, as you can tell. Um, no, three days ago I did my relaxer. One thing I wanted to point out was one of the questions that I was asked in the previous video or comments that was left on my on my page was um, why didn't you uh, put a blow dryer like shot of your relaxer the answer is simple whenever I relax my hair I actually don't blow dry it I air dry it part of it is that in my mind and this is pure paranoia I have no factual evidence to support this but what I notice is that um, or what I feel is that after my hair has been retouched or relaxed I'm worried that it's still fragile and everything and so I don't want to put heat to it unless if I have to so what I do is after the retouch I just wash it out air dry it out put some nice moisturizer to lock it in lock in the moisture and then I call it a day and then like maybe a day or two later what I do again is I uh, put a hair mask or a deep treatment onto my hair and then I, I flat iron it or blow dry it whatever it is that I want to do so that's why the other video did not have a blow dry shot um, and also I think in that video uh, it was my first time to do it so I didn't want to like I was scared basically um, and the other thing you'll notice is that I have a thin hairline over here you can tell In my hair you notice from my older videos on my, my older hair videos my hairline's been pretty much this thin for as long as I've had hair on my head um, the reason is one genetically my family has very thin hair um, so I'm actually my hair is probably the thickest like when I look at my grandma from my mom's side my grandmother and my mother my mother's hair very very thin hair and so I think that's like a side effect. I have tiny eyebrows and tiny hair, um, like hairline stuff. And then the second thing that doesn't make it better is that I, um, I, I'm usually in braids. So for as long, so I can say for the last 10 years or longer, 15 years, or even longer than that, really for as long as I know, I'm always in braids, I'm always in braids, I'm always in braids. This does not help your hairline. Um, but will this stop me from braiding my hair? Absolutely not. I love being in braids sometimes. Um, but now that I've relaxed my hair, I feel like I, I, I probably don't have to be in braids as much as I used to be in braids. So that's that. And um, yeah, so yeah, so don't ask me about my hairline because it's the way it is. So deal with it. In terms of how often I retouch my hair, 
actually don't retouch my hair that often so I do it probably every two months um, and part of this is because I just want to wear my uh, relaxer as long as I can but then also because I don't feel like I need it I think it, my hair when it's um, a little bit textured so when it gets older like when I can start to see that I need a retouch it actually gets much fuller and it's like more um, as opposed to when it just gets relaxed like now it feels a little bit flat even though it's fine and part of it is I have quite a lot of grease in my hair the question is a lot of people who watch my previous videos are uh, ladies who are thinking of relaxing their hair from or from uh, natural hair I can't answer that it's I think it's your own decision if you decide to go relaxed good on you if you decide to stay natural awesome on you I honestly think for me it was a decision I wanted to make for myself I think I found it easier I was just tired of having so much product in my hair and so uh, this was kind of the solution that worked well for me based on my own lifestyle and what I want for myself so um, I think natural hair is beautiful like if you can actually spend the time to really take care of it and be delicate with it um, I think it's awesome and I've seen girls who've got natural hair I'm like yes and I sometimes miss my my sort of 4C uh, coily hair sometimes um, but I can say that this relaxer is gonna be my look for the next couple of years at least so uh, unless something changes then I'll change it up but for now this is what works for me um, but yeah so if you're thinking of going uh, relaxed then do your research um, and make a decision but I ain't gonna make that decision for you uh, hopefully try and do another video a bit later on about some of the other products or hair routines that I have because with with relaxed hair you still have to take care of your hair obviously and uh, but although my hair routine is way simplified now that I'm uh, relaxed so uh, maybe I'll do a video about that if you have any questions at all that I haven't answered in this video please feel free to just ask me and I'll try my best to answer what I can um, but otherwise hope that was useful uh, for those of you who had questions before and thanks for watching and I will 